Hello, 9th standard. This is our video session 7. Today, we are going to do a new chapter 15. Chapter 15, Improvement in Food Resources. In that, we have later half of the portion as of now, that is Animal Husbandry. Animal Husbandry, that means the livestock, livestock no? the management of uh, cow, goat, poultry, those uh, animals, how do we, uh, fisheries, all these animals, how do we maintain them and what are the uses of them that we are going to learn. We are learning about it, we are going to discuss because we have already learned this chapter. Right? The first, it is Animal husbandry. What do we know? Animal husbandry. It is the scientific management of animal livestock. Livestock, na? the cow, goat, uh, poultry, fisheries, alapatina uh, details. It includes various aspects such as feeding, breeding, and disease control. Feeding, na? nutrition. Breeding na reproductive process and it may be affected by the disease and those diseases have to be controlled. <coughs> Animal based farming includes cattle, goat, sheep, poultry and fish farming. livestock. <coughs> as the population increases and as living standards increase, the demand for milk, eggs, and meat is also going up. You understand this line? Also, the growing awareness of need for the human treatment of livestock has brought in the new limitations in livestock farming. Thus, livestock production also needs to be improved. I hope you are able to follow this. Huh? Then, next one is... <coughs> next one is cattle farming. Cattle farming na another as <coughs> cattle husbandry chulo. Animal husbandry la cattle pati pesanala. It is cattle husbandry. It is done for two purposes. One is milk. That the details about the milk yielding milk yielding animals and drought. Drought na, the silo animals are not fit for milk. La. Adala, the drought animals as labor for agricultural work such as tilling, irrigation and cutting. Drought animals are the labor ki use for agriculture work. La. Tilling na, plowing ple, last year. And, uh, maad year uruvala. That is tilling, irrigation, watering. Ke, and carting, matavandi powder, 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 yeah, as a carting. <coughs> Indian cattle belong to two different species. One is Bos indicus and Bos bubalis. Bos indicus na cow, that is yeah, the example in the figure. Bos indicus on the cow and Bos bubalis on the buffalo. The end picture on the cutter cape, Bose indicus and Bose bubalis. Okay, in that milch animals, milk yielding animals are called milch animal. The C with the silent touch on the milk animal. Okay, so it is also called milk yielding animals. They are domestic animals. They are domestic animals. Domestic animal na wheat level kar, chinna level la kar. That yield milk or are kept at suitable for milk production. Some milk producing animals that are present in India are cows, buffaloes, goats and camels. These are the animals. Cows, buffalo, goat and camels are the animals that are milk yielding. Okay. This is for, uh, you should know about these two figures, right? The next one, Adeda, Adeda Then milk production depends to some extent on the duration of the lactation period. Lactation period, na milk, pal, karakar, 
மாடு ஆக்சுவலா மாடு கண்ணு போட்ட உடனே பால் கறக்கும் அதான் லாக்டேஷன் பீரியட் மீனிங் ஆஃப் த பீரியட் ஆஃப் மில் ப்ரொடக்ஷன் ஆப்டர் பர்த் ஆஃப் அ காப் அத காப்னா கண்ணுக்குட்டி மீனிங் ஆஃப் த பீரியட் ஆஃப் மில் ப்ரொடக்ஷன் ஆப்டர் த பர்த் ஆஃப் காப் ரைட் சோ மில் ப்ரொடக்ஷன் கேன் பி இன்கிரீஸ் பை இன்கிரீசிங் த லாக்டேஷன் பீரியட் வெளிநாட்டில் they show excellent resistance to diseases the two can be cross bred to get animals with both desired qualities adade exotic na foreign breed example enna la na ka jersey brown sheep so idu rendu name of the cow they are selected for long lactation period whereas local breed na india la available ulla red sindhi and sahiwal they show excellent resistance to disease what does it mean either endo excellent resistance to disease these two are long lactation period so idu rendu cross breed pannina we will have rendu desired quality um kadaikum <coughs> that is so idella exotic breeds of cow okay the next one adhe da figure kadachadala unak thandirken This is Red Sindhi. This is Sahiwal. This is the Maad Karkar. This is Adder. U-D-D-E-R. This is Adder. Adder is the same. Maad is the Paal Karkar. So this is called Adder. Example is the cow is Sahiwal. That is Murra. It is a breed. The breeding of Murra it is in Haryana and Patiala district. Patiala district in Punjab. Okay. This is about Murra, Red Sindhi and Sahiwal. The next one, it is a cattle breed. For example, figure. It is an exotic breed. It is an Indian breed. Holstein, Friesian, Karan Swiss, Jesse and Brown Swiss. It is a foreign breed. Exotic breed. Holstein, Friesian, current swiss jersey and brown swiss these are all exotic breed idella indian breed so he was gir <coughs> red sindhi and concrete i repeat so he was gir red sindhi and concrete these are all examples of cattle breeds i hope you are able to follow this hmm? the next one the food requirements of dairy animals normally it is of two types <coughs> maintenance requirement which is the food required to support the animal to live a healthy life it is the first maintenance the cattle shed and you should maintain in a neat way so that cleanliness is very much important so that it will support the animal to lead a healthy life then milk producing requirement <coughs> which is the type of food required during lactation period milk producing requirement which is the type of food required during lactation period சரியா சோ ரெண்டு மெயின்டெனன்ஸ் இம்பார்ட்டன்ட் ஒன்னு வந்து மெயின்டெனன்ஸ் ஆஃப் கேட்டல் ஷெட் அடுத்து வந்து milk producing requirement then animal feed normally includes animal feed na and animal saapradhu vande roughage which is largely fiber and concentrates normally cow adu vande pattikotta punna ellu punna kembale namma oorla la nareya kadai புண்ணாக்கு பருத்தி கொட்டை அப்புறம் இந்த கழுநீர் கழுநீர் இந்த அரிசி களைஞ்ச உளுந்து களைஞ்ச தண்ணி எல்லாம் இருக்கு அதெல்லாம் சாப்பிடுறது அதெல்லாம் தான் ரஃபேஜும் கான்சன்ட்ரேட்ஸும் ஆனால் கான்சன்ட்ரேட் வந்து லோ இன் ஃபைபர் 
and contain relatively high level of protein and other nutrients. I hope you understand. You go through panna animal feed includes roughage. Hmm. Which is largely fiber. Another one concentrates which are <coughs> low in fiber and contain relatively high level of protein and other nutrients. Cattle need balanced rations containing all nutrients in proportionate amount. Besides these nutritious food, certain feed additives containing micronutrients will also promote the health and milk output of dairy animals. I hope you are able to follow this. This is the micronutrients which are needed in small quantity. They are also promoting the health and milk output of dairy animals. Then cattle may suffer from number of diseases. The disease besides causing death reduce milk production. A healthy animal feeds regularly and has normal posture. The parasites of cattle may be both external parasite and internal parasite. <coughs> parasite is another organism which live on other living organism. They are called parasites. They may be external that is present outside the body or internal parasite. <coughs> external parasite live on the skin and mainly cause skin diseases. Whereas internal parasite they are like worms and affect stomach and intestine while flu damage the liver. Liver flu particularly Platy helminthes liver fluke. That is affecting the affecting as a parasite. Then infectious diseases, they are also caused by bacteria and viruses. Vaccinations are given to form animal against many major viral and bacterial diseases. This is about the disease. The next one. Poultry farming. It all under the cattle farming person. Ipo under poultry farming. What does it? Poultry farming <coughs> is undertaken to raise domestic fowl for egg production and chicken meat. Therefore, improved poultry breeds are developed and formed to produce layers for eggs and lay broilers for meat. <coughs> Normally, the poultry is egg layers and broiler. Silla hens they are meant for egg laying only. Some of them are broiler for meat. Broiler and the urcha kodi chulwala as a broiler. The kadela mate pala urcha kodi bajimari putterwala as a broiler. Whereas some other type one they are meant only for egg laying. So that is all the they produce layers for eggs and broilers. <coughs> Examples are Legon, Legon, Hen and Cock. Then White Plymouth Rock. This is Hen and Cock. This is Light Brahma, Hen and Cock. This is Asil, typical and Asil, Hen and Cock. Hen and Cock meaning is not that. So Legon, White Primoth Rock, Light Brahma, Silky and Asil. Inon on the Chittakong never. Adho in the type. So these are all examples for poultry farming. Okay. Now here, Legon a particular. Legon, it weights in the just to go through particular. Now just out of interest I have given this. Picture is important. In the details, we are out of interest. <coughs> Hen is 2 kg. Eggshell is color white. <coughs> and then, an egg type, chicken, excellent laying. These are all lay, these uh, leg are meant for laying eggs. Then, it is 300 eggs per year. 
and then it is a city of Legon from Italy. <coughs> then a small compact light body, active, small head with well set up comb. Is a comb. Nearest of all bird. Nearest of all bird. Nearest. Bade patale nearest. Right. Then a seal. It is famous for its fighting quality. The Kolichanda Purule, Adakunde, a seal variety. Famous for its fighting quality. This variety is a good table. Table bird with plenty of flesh and has delicious taste and pleasant flavor. The capacity, <coughs> this cup, is it clama? So this asil, is variety is good table bird <coughs> with plenty of flesh and has delicious taste and pleasant flavor. The capacity of egg laying is poor but again hen is a good sitter. And then the egg laying is a good sitter. Then Plymouth rock, <coughs> you know, excellent fleshing property. Used for broiler production. It is originated from America. It possesses long deep body. Long deep body, single coat. In the chapar per. single coat. Grayish white plumage, black bar. In the Odambu fulla. The era here, Kori era. The plumage. And auto sexing, brown egg. It lays eggs in brown color. The next one. These are all example Indian breeds. Chittagong, Asil and Karaknot. There are indigenous fowls, indigenous breed. India level. Indigenous na India level. Asiatic one Brahma, Lanksha or Asiatic breed. Exotic breed na <coughs> Rende mix panadu. Plymouth Rock, Legon, Rhode Island, Black Minarka are examples. Edala, Plymouth Rock, Legon, Rhode Island, Black Menarka. <coughs> These are all exotic breeds. I hope you understand. Hmm? Now this poultry, they are famous in Tamil Nadu. As Tamil Nadu government is giving much importance to poultry industry. Namakkal, Palladam and Chennai are well known for poultry industries. Each child is given egg on all working days of school. <coughs> Midday meal tarale so the Namakal, Pallada and Chennai are given importance for poultry industry, right? Then it is the <coughs> about the details cross breeding program between Indian, that is indigenous asil example and foreign exotic for example Lagon. Breeds for a variety of improvement are focused to develop new varieties for the following desirable trait. Trait na character. As number and quality of chick. Dwarf broiler parent for commercial chick production. Summer adaptation capacity and tolerance to high temperature. <coughs> In the temperature na lo, it has to have the adaptation capacity, low maintenance requirement, reduction in the size of the egg laying bird with the ability to utilize more fibrous, cheap diet. That is the formulating using agricultural byproduct. This is for uh, characters to be followed. Okay. Next one the fish production. Fish is a chief source of animal protein for food. <coughs> First one the cattle patho. After the poultry. <coughs> After the one the fish production. Fisheries chodole. Nama tutu kudil arke. Rumba famous fisheries. Fish is a chief source of animal protein for food. Fish production includes the finned true fish. Finned true fish na. Fin circle as well as shellfish. Shellfish officially one the normal pieces of fishes. And a shellfish one the <coughs> lower invertebrate. The insects like prawn variety 
அதுவும் முலஸ்கால வந்து இந்த ஸ்னெயில் ஆப்பிள் ஸ்னெயில் படிப்போமே அந்த அது ரெண்டையும் பேரு ஷெல் ஃபிஷ் சொல்லுவோம் ஐ ஹோப் ஐ அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் ஸோ இந்த பிஸ்ஸஸ்ல உள்ள ஃபிஷ்ஷும் அதான் ட்ரூ ஃபிஷ் ஷெல் ஃபிஷ் வந்து தே ஆர் நாட் ட்ரூ ஃபிஷ் பட் ஆஸ் தே ஹாவ் ஸ்கெலிட்டன் அண்ட் ஸ்கேல்ஸ் ஏ ஆர் செப்ரான்ஸ் அண்ட் மொலஸ் தே ஆர் கால் ஷெல் ஃபிஷ் தெர் ஆர் டூ வேஸ் ஆஃப் அப்டைனிங் ஃபிஷ் ஒன் இஸ் ஃப்ரம் நேச்சுரல் ரிசோர்ஸ் விச் இஸ் கால் கேப்சர் ஃபிஷிங் அதர் வே இஸ் பை ஃபிஷ் ஃபார்மிங் விச் இஸ் கால் கல்ச்சர் ஃபிஷரி உனக்கு இது ரொம்ப இம்பார்ட்டண்டாக தெரிஞ்சிருக்கணும் இதில் டூ வேஸ் ஒன் இஸ் கேப்சர் ஃபிஷரி அனதர் ஒன் கல்ச்சர் ஃபிஷரி நேச்சுரல் வே ஆஃப் கலெக்டிங் ஃபிஷஸ் அந்த ஃபிஷ் ஃபார்மிங் வந்து கேப்சர் ஃபிஷிங் ஆர்டிஃபிஷியல் மெத்தடில் பண்ணுறது வந்து கல்ச்சர் ஃபிஷரி okay the water source of the fish can be either sea water or fresh water and it is as river or pond fishing can thus be in a pannandirk <coughs> fishing can thus be done both by capture and culture of fish in marine and fresh water ecosystem fishing can thus be done can be carried out both by capture fishing natural way or culturing the fishes and it may be from marine water or fresh water ecosystem i hope you understand <coughs> then popular marine fisheries include pomfret <coughs> popular marine fish varieties that include pomfret mackerel tuna sardine and பாம்பே டக் இது மூணு மூணு எக்ஸாம்பிள் இதுதான் டியூனா நினைக்கிறது டியூனா இது வந்து மேக்ரல் சார்டை ஓகே இது மூணு எக்ஸாம்பிள் வந்து இந்த மூணு தான் டியூனா சார்டை மேக்ரல் மெரைன் ஃபிஷ் ஆர் காட் யூசிங் மெனி கைண்ட் ஆஃப் ஃபிஷிங் ஃபிஷிங் நெட்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் ஃபிஷிங் போட்ஸ் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் வந்து டியூனா செகண்ட் வந்து சார்டை தேர்டு வந்து மேக்ரல் இத மூணு எக்ஸாம்பிள் சொல்லிருக்கேன் ஓகே த நெக்ஸ்ட் ஒன் இன்லேண்ட் ஃபிஷரிஸ் ஃபிஷரிஸ்ல வந்து நம்ம ஃப்ரெஷ் வாட்டர் ரிசோர்ஸ் வந்து இன்லேண்ட் ஃபிஷரிஸ் சொல்லுவோம் ஸோ ஃப்ரெஷ் வாட்டர் ரிசோர்ஸஸ் இன்க்ளூட் கெனால் பாண்ட் ரிசர்வாயர்ஸ் அண்ட் ரிவர் டேம் சொல்லுவோம் இல்லையா ரிசர்வாயர் தான் பிராக்கிஷ் வாட்டர் ரிசோர்ஸஸ் வேர் சீ வாட்டர் அண்ட் ஃப்ரெஷ் வாட்டர் மிக்ஸ் டுகெதர் சச்சஸ் Fisheries and lagoons, they are also important fish reservoir. If you have a small fish, you can see the fish in the water. Right? Brackish water resources, where sea water and fresh water, they mix together. And the area is the fisheries and lagoons. They are also important for fish reservoir. well capture fishing is also done in such inland water bodies but yield is not high and thanni odinde irukum the river idilla most fish production from these sources is through aquaculture that fishing method is called aquaculture so fish culture is sometimes done in combination with the rice crop <coughs> so that fish are grown in the water in the paddy field adum irukum paddy ki vande nareya thanni venum namma padichirukom illa rabi crop and carrot crop nu namma ponosham padichome adhula vande rice need more retention of water so like paddy field is it not in that if fishes are grown that can also be taken as a culture so more intensive fish farming can be done in composite fish culture system adavad rendu moonu varieties of fish can be grown in a fish culture method both local and imported fish species are used in such system okay here one problem with uh, such composite fish culture every rendu moonu fish vechi nam composite fish culture pannina there may be a problem as one fish may be breeding only during monsoon or other way where a different growth season so even if fish seed is collected from the wild it can be mixed with that of the other species as well 
so another uh, one problem with this composite fish culture is that many of these fish breed only during monsoon season podhuva solluvalle and the main body tadai kalam net and the fishermen nikla solluva appo epana the fishes are allowed to breed breeding na reproduction method 40 naal main body ke poopadad en solluvalle adhu da main body tadai kalam adha during Yeah. So at the same time, even if fish seed is collected from the wild, it can be mixed with that of other species. So that you can learn along in the breeding season. So a major problem in fish farming is lack of availability of good quality seed. The seed referring to young ones. The fishes are. allowed the eggs are allowed to hatch at the seed seed na nammalo and the seed kedaiyadu idu and the fish seed link adu per to overcome this problem we how now been worked out to breed this fish in pond using hormonal stimulation and the mari to come out of this problem hormonal stimulation molo uniform the good quality seed can be obtained this has ensured the supply of pure fish seed in desired quantities namak endha maadhiri fish seedling venumo adha vande pannalam eppadi through hormonal stimulation seriya then idella example for fishes இது வந்து ஃப்ரெஷ் வாட்டர் ஃபிஷ் கட்லா கட்லா இது வந்து பைனாமியல் நேம் கட்லா ஃபிஷ் கட்லா கட்லா ரோஹு லாபியோ ரோஹிட்டா மிரகால் சிரினஸ் மிரகுலா நம்ம சொல்லுவோம்ல கொடுவா மீன் வஞ்சிர மீன் அப்படி சொல்லுவோம்ல அதெல்லாம் தான் இது கட்லா கட்லா ரோஹு லாபியோ ரோஹிட்டா மிரகால் சிரினஸ் மிரகுலா அண்ட் மரைன் ஃபிஷ் வந்து சீ பாஸ் grey mullet and milk fish example pathuko na illa ulla binomial kepen fresh water la rohu od binomial mrigal od binomial la kepen this you need to study i hope you understand this hmm? the next one is na sonna illa the fish vande nama vande normal ட்ரூ ஃபின்டு ஃபிஷ்னு சொல்லுவோம் அதெல்லாம் அந்த ப்ரீவியஸ் இது படிச்சது இது வந்து ஷெல் ஃபிஷ் ஷெல் ஃபிஷ்னா இந்த மசில் பிரான்னோட இந்த சாரி ஃப்ரெஷ் வாட்டர் மசில்னு சொல்லுவோம் ஆப்பிள் ஸ்னெயில் மொலஸ்கா இருக்குல்ல அதோடது அண்ட் தென் பிரான்னுட்டு பயில மாத்திர போடால படிப்போம் நம்ம இந்த ஈரால்னு இந்த நான்வெஜ் சாப்பிட்றாள அதுதான் இது ஃப்ரெஷ் வாட்டர் பிரான் ஈரால் இது வந்து மெரைன் வாட்டர் பிரான் ஐ ஹோப் ஐ அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் இது வந்து ஷ்ரெம்ப்பா ஷ்ரெம்ப்னா இந்த மீன் இந்த பிரான் குஞ்சு குட்டி குட்டியா இருக்கும் அது பேரு ஷ்ரெம்ப் இது பெருசா வளர்ந்த இந்த ரெண்டு பிரான் இப்ப இட் இஸ் அ ஃப்ரெஷ் வாட்டர் பிரான் திஸ் வில் பி த சைஸ் இப் இட் இஸ் மெரைன் வாட்டர் பிரான் திஸ் வில் பி த சைஸ் ஐ ஹோப் யூ அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் சோ திஸ் இஸ் கால்ட் ஷ்ரெம்ப் எஸ் ஹெச் ஐ ஆர் எம் பி ஓகே இது வந்து பேடி கம் prawn and fish culture that is paddy is on the paddy field water is retained retention of water all the fish is there and so the fish culture can be done in the paddy also that is the one that we have studied in previous uh, presentation okay the next one <coughs> is about shellfish shellfish is a culinary term for some aquatic invertebrates used as food mollusk crustacean and echinoderm idella shellfish in the orange color la theriyadalla prawn inda idella theriyadalla arrow la kattrene idella mollusk and shellfish okay my invertebrates used as food mollusk crustacean and echinoderms it's not a scientific term and it is used may vary from place to place and uh, both salt water and fresh water invertebrates are considered as shellfish mollusk commonly used as food include clam indha idellam da the arrow la kattrenle illa clam mussel 
oyster, winkle and scallop. Clam, mussel, oyster, winkle and scallop. I hope you are able to read this. Clam, mussel, oyster, winkle and scallop. Some crustaceans commonly eaten are shrimp. Shrimp chanelli and the kutikute prawn. Shrimp, prawn, peris. Lobster, the arrow laka river. Idilla, lobster. And then crayfish. The peri, crayfish and crab. Kunji et purme padi. Dark and panine ana the parle. I repeat. Shrimp, prawn. Lobster, crayfish and crab. Echinoderms are not eaten as commonly as mollusk and crustaceans. In Asia, it is sea cucumber. In Asia, sea cucumber and sea urchin. In Asia, sea cucumber and C urchin, U R C H I N. I repeat, C urchin, U R C H I N, are eaten. So here, I repeat, echinoderms are not eaten as commonly as mollusks and crustaceans. In Asia, C cucumber and C urchin. I repeat. S E A urchin U R C H I N C urchins are eaten. The shellfish paragraph very important in this Okay. The next one, this is uh, fish culture. Fish culture land spawn production refer. Fish seed. The kutikita in the chadra chadrama katikati Adalanda ready ready for the fish bed i could fish seed and stocking of fingerling in happas idu per da happa indha mari chadara chadaruma katta katti irukka per idella fish seed ara patta fish seed idella happa fingerlings vande idil irundhu idu konjam valandaatte idu kulla poduva namma vande frog life cycle padichirukom illaya egg tadpole and the tadpole stage further over mari idu vande egg seeds konja valandaatte and the fish fingerlinga idu kulla poduva seriya and then this is stocking pond nariya theriyudhu va idhula da actually fish will be growing thoroughly i hope you understand huh? the next one this is freshwater aquaculture idu marine water aquaculture normally idu vande nee those are coming to Chennai or from here when you are going. The Chengal Patla is a lake. In the lake, in the Madari, uh, aquaculture will be planted. That will be seen very clearly. So, this is freshwater aquaculture. This is marine water aquaculture. There is a difference in the ECA country. It is sea water, somewhat bluish in color. It is fresh water. The manala tanida teriyade. It is the sea water. I hope you understand. Hmm? The next one is beekeeping. Beekeeping another that is uh, honey production. Atliya, that is beekeeping. So so far in alam bachirko. First cattle, then poultry, third one the Fisheries and then next one the beekeeping. Beekeeping la honey is widely used and therefore beekeeping for making honey has become an agricultural enterprise. Since beekeeping needs low investment, farmers use it as an additional income generating activity. In addition to honey, the beehives are source of wax which is used in various medicinal preparation. The beehive is the ten kudu chalula and the beehive. The local varieties of bees are used for commercial honey production. Apis serana indica commonly known as Indian bee. 
then a pis dorsata the rock b and a pis floria the little b then an italian b variety a pis mellifera has also been brought into increase yield of honey this is the variety of commonly you variety this is the variety commonly used for commercial honey production i repeat apis indica serana vechuko apis indica indian bee apis dorsata rock bee apis floria little bee right then italian bee vandu apis mellifera i hope you are able to follow this this is bee keeping idile a ipo thana chonne as indigenous and exotic variety apis dorsata also known as rock bee or wild bee apis floria little bee then apis indica indian bee then exotic varieties apis mellifera italian bee and apis adamsoni african bee then these are queen uh, bees as you know honey bees are queen bee worker bee and drone bee queen bee and in a bee hive there is only one queen bee and then few uh, male drone bees are male and others are worker bees and this is a honeycomb the ten kudu chonnolla that is honeycomb adilla ella bees type of bees are present okay so now idilla the italian bees have high honey collection capacity they sting somewhat less sting in the quarter which you know they sting somewhat less they stay in a given behave for a long period and breed very well <coughs> commercial honey bee production commercial honey bee production bee farms or apiaries apiaries na the honey bee is or established for commercial honey bee production bee farms or apiaries are established the value or quality of honey depends upon the pasturage or flowers available to the bees for nectar and pollen collection it is a very important point you have to learn value or quality of honey depends upon the pasturage that is the flower la answer la evlova nectar irukku and the nectar vande evlova and the bees edukum adhu da pasturage na that is what the value or quality of honey depends upon the pasturage or the flowers available to the bees for nectar and pollen collection so in addition to adequate quantity of pasturage the kind of flowers available will determine the taste of the honey in the end point is very important for the bee keeping bee keeping na apiculture nu solluvom le so the bee keeping or apiculture la in the end point is very important is pasturage that is availability of the honey in a given and the in a given flower normally the uh, flowers la than honey nectar irukum the pollen la than nectar irukum the pollen grain la evlo nectar adu and the insects nal evlo edukka mudiyum adu da pasturage so the value or quality of honey depends upon the pasturage on flowers available to the bees adukku and ethana flower irukana for the nectar and pollen collection in addition to adequate quantity of pasturage the kind of flowers available will determine the taste of honey ella flowers la ulla honey um namukku eppadi irukum pollen nectar um eppadi irukum gnu theriyadhu illa so the nature of the flowers available will determine the taste of the honey i hope you are able to follow this huh? so this is for the apiculture so now we have done this is another animal husbandry under that the topic is improvement in food resources 
அதில் வந்து நான் லேட்டர் ஹாஃப் ஆஃப் த போர்ஷனில் நமக்கு இப்போ நான் சொல்லி கொடுத்துருக்கேன் தட் இஸ் அனிமல் ஹஸ்பண்ட்ரி அண்டர் த யூ ஹவ் லேர்ன்ட் கேட்டில் ஃபீட் கேட்டில் இது இது போட்டு கேட்டில் அண்ட் தென் அ டைப் ஆஃப் மில்க் ப்ரீட் அண்ட் தென் எக்ஸாம்பிள்ஸ் நீ வந்து அதுக்கு பார்க்கணும் அண்ட் தென் பவுல்ட்ரி ஃபார்மிங் அண்ட் தென் ஃபிசிகல்ச்சர் ஃபிஷ் ஃபார்மிங் தான் ஃபிசிகல்ச்சர் ஆர் அக்வா கல்ச்சர்னு சொல்லலாம் அதில் வந்து ஃபிஷ் கல்ச்சரில் நம்ம ரெண்டு வந்து ட்ரூ ஃபிஷ் அண்ட் ஷெல் ஃபிஷ் ட்ரூ ஃபிஷ் வந்து த நார்மல் ஃபின்டு ஃபிஷ்ஷஸ் ஆர் கால்டு ட்ரூ ஃபிஷ் அண்ட் தென் அதில் வந்து ஃப்ரெஷ் வாட்டர் அண்ட் மெரைன் வாட்டர் ஃபிஷ்ஷஸ் இருக்குது அந்த ஃபிகரை வச்சு எக்ஸாம்பிள் அண்ட் பைனாமேல் யூ ஷுட் நோ ரைட் அண்ட் தென் ஷெல் ஃபிஷ் வந்து எல்லாமே இன்வெர்டி பிரேஸ் அதோட இம்பார்ட்டன்ஸும் உனக்கு தெரிஞ்சிருக்கணும் தென் நெக்ஸ்ட் இது வந்து பி கல்ச்சர் தான் ஏபி கல்ச்சர் தான் பி கல்ச்சர் தட் யூ ஷுட் ஐ ஹோப் யூ அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் இந்த பி கல்ச்சரில் அல்லது செரி கல்ச்சரில் வந்து அந்த சாரி பீ கீப்பிங்கில் வந்து யூ ஷுட் நோ ஏபி கல்ச்சர் பி கல்ச்சர்னு ஏபி கல்ச்சரில் அந்த எக்ஸாம்பிள்ஸ் ஆஃப் ஆல் த த்ரீ வெரைட்டிஸ் and then about the pasturage you should know i hope you are able to follow this yeah? so this is for improvement in food resources that you have i hope you have understood you will go through the earlier uh, portion also so that uh, creative questions can also be asked from that portion we'll continue in the next session thank you